Welcome everyone to the 21st video of my Wealth of Nations EU4 Let's Play. So the war against Denmark's gone really well in the last video. Uh, they've been attacked by myself and the Swedish Alliance as well. Uh, so it's just a case of what territories do I want to take from them. I've pretty much sieged up the ones that I've got claims on. Uh, so I just have to get my war score to about 80 before I'll make peace probably. Uh, so this is, I'm probably going to take those three territories and Osel as well, and I'm not sure if I'll take any more than that, otherwise my aggressive expansion might be a bit too much. I'm probably going to have to re-ally to Sweden as well, otherwise I'd cause a huge amount of uh, aggressive expansion with them, but it's pretty likely that uh, I'm going to end up being a rival to Sweden at some point, I think. Um, it's only a matter of time. Uh, hopefully I can take most of the Denmark out first before we get involved in uh, wars of Sweden now. Uh, right, so I should uh, get started anyway, I think. So I've got an army coming over there, so I'm going to send that to Bornholm. And uh, it's just most of Norway, the old Norway, which hasn't been sieged up pretty much now. So I've got to do that. I should send my first colonist as well. That's a colony, hopefully, in this video. Uh, so, they can come up there. Okay, let's uh, send those over to Bornholm. My fleet stairs, uh, our main army stairs, what am I going to do with this? Um, probably going to have to use my fleet to get units anywhere. We're in charge of that, and everywhere else is sieged up over here. So I'm not going to be able to dislodge them. Um, right. Okay, right, Munster was taken. Uh, looks like Austria took that. Take those off and um, bring those up here. Lunenburg's always also taken. I may take that in this war. Not sure yet. Right. Notre Dame Bay. Okay. They can go to there. Right, still haven't found anything over here yet. Um move that to there. I have to colonize Greenland first, after all. Okay, right, army's reaching there. Um, I think what I'm going to do is detach... Detach a couple of Carracks and a cog fleet. And, um... They can uh, go up there. I'll send the army up there as well. Move them across here to siege up. I think Demak's army's. I got a bit left somewhere by the looks of it. Uh, so I need to siege up these claims before Denmark, uh, Sweden does. That's what my priority is now. Okay. Um, I'll put those back out to a uh, blockade there as well. Riga, right. Put those up, attach. Alright, right, the Danish army's there. So I need to be a bit careful about landing troops here, actually. That's there. Still haven't found anything. Um, 28th? Yeah, I could just about do that, I think. France. Okay. How is France losing those wars? 
They haven't lost their military, have they? Got quite a coalition against them now. No, they got a huge military. Okay. Right, Sweet is in charge of that. Sadly, they're not going to move off either now. Uh, they can go to there. I'm going to there then. Right, looks like we finally uh, discovered something. So that's out of range. Um, Colonial range is only 240. Oh, I haven't got Diplotech 7, that's why. So how much will it be with Diplotech 7? Um, 115 extra. So it'd be 355. That's 290 away. It looks like it's a, a tribe there, so that's where I'd probably colonize, but I'm not going to be able to if there is a tribe there. So I might have to explore Greenland after all. Right, so let's bring that back to there. Right. Um, whoa, Castile, I got here already. Okay. It's a bit odd that they're colonizing North America. Um, very odd. That's a problem, actually, if they nick all this land around here. I'm not going to be able to. Well, there should be land up there for me to colonize to get down here. Ah, uh, right. Right, one at Osel. I'll, uh... What's that? Thorny and Novgorod. That's there. And, um... Troops can come for us there. Right, so they colonized there as well. This sucks, actually. Why are steel colonizing up here? That's like makes no sense for them to do that at all. Right, so which there? there. They moved off. Yes, they have. Okay. Surprisingly. Right. Right to there. Haven't taken that yet. those up and move them on there. Right, if my admin points are about to go over, but I think I'm ahead in time here. I'm one year ahead of time. I could spend some admin points and buildings. Let's have a look. It's temples. 0.91 for Holstein. A constable. Not sure what's affecting these numbers, I need to figure this out. Um so Bremen's point seven oh that's a good one. Point nine three. Point seven five for Bremen, I'll do that as well. Right. Okay. 
Okay, fleet reached uh, Reykjavik. Then on patrol. Yeah, let's find uh, Greenland then, after all. This is 355, wasn't it? Yeah, I could have done there. That's what I would have done if it still hadn't gotten there first. So I'm going to have to colonize here, basically. Pretty sure of it now. Um, there's not much point to me spending this on Diplotech until I've found somewhere I can colonize anyway, so I'll wait a bit. Right. And, um, move off there. Okay, so there's a Danish army around here somewhere. I'm gonna group those up. I leave Merc Cannon. And what's the supply in the area? 15, it's really bad, so there and there. Okay. To 59%. I need 80, I think. So diplomat is back. I shall improve relations with um, Austria, Sweden. Luckily, they give me an alliance. Still, so I'm going to be doing that in a bit. Uh, right, so my admin's about to go over next month. Do I want to make any more buildings? To be honest, I don't think I'd probably do. Um, Old Stein I could do, actually. How about the temple there? The constable. I still want to save up for an embassy. Right, I'll leave it at that. And I'll spend this on January to go to the next tent. So it's not a year ahead. Save myself 60 from that, I think. Um, okay. Revel is taken. Right, that's all taken. So there's Gotland, which I should siege up. I'm going to move those back onto Osul. And um, that's been sieged up. Where's this fleet to? I'll bring that to there. that. Attach there. Move to there. Right. I should probably have a look what piece did I can get. So I went Osul. Wouldn't mind taking Lunaburg. Let's check my claims. Um... I won't take that in this war, probably. So we're at 36. Uh, then uh, Sweden would be a crazy amount. That's probably too much, isn't it, actually? Um, if I take that one off, how much would it be? That might be manageable. France is 32. Venice is powerful, it's 32. Um, I need to ally Sweden to reduce that. That's probably the deal I'm going to do. So what else can I get? It's only 47. Uh, revoke cause, they, that costs diplo points. I don't want to do those. Release nations. Um, I don't think there's any points in that really. No treaties. I don't want them to do that. Uh, happy with them using up their diplo slots on weak nations. I probably don't want to do any of those either. I could make peace now, actually. Um, taking money. I think I'm going to take a, a minute, uh, or I'm going to take a few seconds to figure this deal out. This, I might make peace now. 
Okay, I think I'm going to make peace now then. I've got the deals that I want to do. It will annoy England and Austria because I'm not going to give them their claims. Uh, the reason, another reason for making peace now is so that uh, I can basically declare war before Sweden does next time round. And hopefully we'll be in an alliance so I'd be able to take the terms of the next war. Uh, so they wouldn't be able to take territory. There will be territory taken from Denmark by Sweden and their allies though in this war. Not going to be able to stop that from happening though. Uh, so there's any missions I can do there. I'm going to take uh, take Finn. Still no sound hole one which I want. Actually it doesn't give me the option to do that there. It's different. Right. I think um, Sirana mentioned that in the comments at some stage. Yeah. So that's pain. Um, yeah, so I need to get this diplomat back first. I make an uh, alliance with Sweden to lower the aggressive expansion. So, um, also I've left, not uh, done this for a while, so what's the cap? 54. I'm still in charge of that one, actually. Um, I could go for that Bavarian one. Yeah, why not? Let's go for it. Right. And, uh... I won't get my troops back quite yet. I'll just leave them where they are for the time being. I right, took the Icelandic territory. I could take that in this war actually. Uh, would it increase aggressive expansion much? Um, Sweden 75. So 75, 59. That's the top two tiers. So it's 4, 3. I could get away with that maybe. I don't think I will though, because it's Norwegian. I might want to release Norway as a vassal and Diplo feed and all that stuff. Vassal feed. Uh, right, so still waiting on this diplomat. Tron Blank sent the siege. We've reached there. Okay, diplomat's back. Yeah, can't do that. So I'm going to ally with Sweden. Alliance send. Enter the alliance. Now this should be reduced for Sweden. Yeah. Can you even see Sweden on it? It is there somewhere. But I can't see it. Um, it was like 70 up before. There they are. Uh, minus 24 Sweden will be. So that's one heck of a difference just for ally in them. So that's going to stop them from joining the coalition and uh, will give me various other benefits. Uh, so let's make peace. So, uh, Osol, uh, Schooner, two islands there, Lolland and um, Finn. Uh, what else? None of that because it costs double points. I don't want to do that either. Don't want to do that. None of the treaties. What's the maximum money? 63, I've got that. So, send a man. Put the time down a second. Okay. Now, that means I could core up a territory as well before I go over my amount. Uh, let's just have a look. So, which of these are going to take the longest? Uh, 33, 33, 57. So I'll do Osel first. It's 20. Um, I might do an So how much am I earning admin per month? I'm earning 10, 11 now. Wow. Well, um, so there's one, two, three months. Is that right? I can't count. Uh, right, so. Let's get my fleets and armies back. Um, up to there. Ah, uh, they can move to there. That is that gonna no, it's got no cogs there. Uh, those are mercs, I'll disband those. 
And uh what's that? Oh uh, I need to grab those in a minute. I think I'll grab those now actually. Okay, any missions? Integrate skein. And the sound tower, oh typically it turns up now. Um Oh, can I do that? One of the following must be true. Control schooner, control sealand. Yeah, I can do it now. Hopefully this completes now. Excellent. Right, so uh, Lubeck gets free shipping through the sounds until 2nd of January 1821. Local trade power plus 5. I don't know... Is that just Lubeck? I think it might be. Yeah. Is that right? Yeah, plus 5. Yeah, it's just Lubeck, but it's better than nothing. Right, great. Uh, so the next mission. Kurland, I could claim. I do integra integrate gain. I don't need the Melgy power, do I? A schooner. Probably pronouncing that wrong. Um, right, so yeah, I just got to get all the stuff back now. Uh, stick my maintenance down. Let's do some harsh treatment. Can use this pretty liberally now. So do it on Lolland. It's expensive. I'm not sure if we're going to do it on that, but probably will. Oh, it's pretty low on there for some reason. I'll do it there. Right. Okay, so I actually had to stop recording for the day, so I'm recording this uh, last part of this video a day later. I've had some time since then to uh, think about what I'm doing and what my overall strategy is, especially with colonizing. I'm going to get to that a bit shortly though. Uh, first of all, I should probably show you something. In that recent war, it's actually damaged relations with Austria more than I uh, would have liked. You can see there, it's minus 44 for not giving them uh, one of their claims or cause in that war. They had taken a new track which they have a claim on. So I've got to be much more careful about that in future, I think. Um, it may have even affect trust as well. I'm not sure. It says something about upholding bargains. That isn't exactly a high level of trust. England also uh, there's uh, more damage from not giving them Orkney. They seem to trust us a bit more though. So I could potentially lose my alliance with Austria which definitely wouldn't be good. Um, I think I'm a, a day more forward actually than uh, when I stop recording. I think I let it run on a day. Um, what else am I doing though? Colonization. Now, Castile has been trolling us by colonizing here, which was where I was planning on colonizing. I actually loaded up a game as Norway to try and figure out uh, what the colonial distance range would be from Reykjavik, which is going to be my nearest uh, to, uh, well, everywhere. And there's quite a few more provinces that should be in range of me when I get my Diplotech up to Diplotech 7 shortly. My range should become 412. And that covers quite a few things. There's Bermuda down here, which I should be able to colonize. Might even be able to colonize a bit down here. I think the northern part of the Caribbean islands, uh, northeastern part, I should be able to colonize because of the trade winds. So it doesn't look like I will have to colonize Greenland just to colonize at the moment. I think I can uh, do other things. Now, because, well, I want to show off the trading companies, Africa is a big priority of mine. Portugal has actually taken uh, Morocco, which I hadn't realized before. That's not very good for me at all. That could uh, cause me issues. But yeah, I need to try and get down here as quickly as possible before Portugal colonizes everything. So, I think I think I will try and find Bermuda first. I'm not going to try and find Greenland. It's not that good. And then maybe I'll try and find down here. It's quite a long distance away from me. This is on patrol. Bermuda, I think, is a couple more 
down here so I'll put that back on patrol and it will come back out when it's repaired I'm even tempted to hire a second explorer actually um, so after that war I've got some new territory so I can increase my force limits I think I'm gonna buy another heavy ship and a bark so let's do that uh, that's it. early Carrack which one's the quickest uh, Hamburg I'll build a bark there I might build on the same side actually right and I can also increase my force limits then so what do I want I will want some mercs to actually uh, protect against natives wherever I'm colonizing so I need to keep some of those I probably should hire some more cannons shouldn't I so let's hire a couple more cannons then somewhere um, so I had a cannon there. I'm not even sure where my army's. My army's still over the place, isn't it? Uh, cannon there. And um, what was I? Five short. Guess I make some more infantry. Right. Yeah, that'll do. Okay, right, so I should uh, get started. I've got Diplomat Spear now. What am I going to do with them? Um, no idea with... Uh, Bohemia doesn't like me. Bohemia is a vassal now, isn't it? So I don't really have to keep relations up with them. I still don't know how that happened with France. Um, let's turn to a small German... Miners here, which I probably should increase relations with before they join the coalition. Okay, have relations, relations. Okay, right, let's get started. Yeah, they all joining coalitions now, not good. Um, gonna turn that down. I'm wondering if my relationship stop, but I'm gonna keep it for the time being. Right, so those can move on to there. It's probably quicker to dock up, isn't it? Maybe not. Okay. He makes no longer a valid rival. Uh, right, let's check this out. Uh, Sweden, I can now rival, and Venice. Now, I don't want to rival Sweden yet. I think I want to try and get involved. Um, they could rival me in a bit, but yeah, I don't want to rival them yet. And Venice. Uh, how much are we lose in there? Three. I'm going to hold off on these, but I might put Venice on in a bit, and I definitely will be putting on Sweden at some point as well. Okay, so we've reached Agder. I've got a wait for a fleet to come back Diplomats back from Sweden let's improve relations with England okay and um Russian from Baltic right so these can make their way to um Slesvig. way to there actually. I don't know revolting yet. Okay, are they cogs there? No. Right. Okay. Timer up. Ah, uh, right, so they can group up there. They can move to there. Okay. Alright, so they can go there. 
here even. Uh, oh wow, got lucky and got a cardinal, excellent. Now the reformation's coming very soon, so arguably I shouldn't be getting cardinals, but um, I'm going reformed and um, there's very little chance that I will initially trigger the reformation anyway because I haven't taken uh, innovative, which you kind of need to be able to do that for the reform religion. So I don't think I'm, it's good to trigger the reformation itself, but since I'm not going to be able to, I'm going to keep cardinals. Cardinals do pref uh, prevent that, I think, that from happening, or at least uh, give it, make it a lot less likely. I can't quite remember, actually. Uh, I have to check the event files. It's probably about 30, 40 years before Reformation starts, though. Uh, reformed Reformation, at least. Right. It's appeared yet. Okay, so we should there. Right, it's, it's uh, January. I think I wasted a couple of admin points then, but it's not a big deal. I'm going to take uh, this next tech. Right. And I'm probably over time for this video, so I think I'll call it an end of the video here. Okay, so thank you for watching. Uh, in the next video, then I will actually send that colonist somewhere. Uh, I know I thought I was going to do it this video, but... Uh, can still kind of stop me and uh, apart from that I'm gonna be getting close to the next war I think well it's a while for that truce to run out actually right so uh, thanks for watching again and I'll see you next time